there how's all of you guys doing today it's a beautiful morning again up here just coming into the uh, Kansas City area I'm still on the Missouri side but uh, got some kind of traffic jam going on up here today but that's all right we'll get through it eventually if not today then tomorrow right if not tomorrow then the day after right eventually we'll get through here so we'll make it home eventually but uh, had me a good night's sleep and here we go hammer down towards home no i just thought this was something really cool eh? they uh, got these uh, big oversized uh, buildings up here i just thought uh figure i show this to you guys it's a really really cool looking truck up here I know it's super windy out here, but I uh, figure I'm going to try and show it to you anyways, no matter what. Sorry for the wind blast, but I can't help it. Just super, super windy up here. But just a nice, nice looking truck. I like that color that he's got on that track, right? But uh, anyways, just figure i show you something interesting. Got some uh, nice buildings, you know. But that's where I got my truck. Just did a circle check on my truck. I'm ready to go again. All right. I don't know why it has to be so super windy today. It's like 30, 30 mile an hour wind today. And I have to go against the wind too, you know. So, yeah, I'm not doing so good on fuel mileage today, but Oh well, one of those days, chalk it in the books and hopefully tomorrow will be a better day, right? But anyways, we'll get going here. We'll see, see what we find today, interesting things. See if we see something interesting today. Anyways, we'll be back in a bit. Well, here I am. I am in Fargo, North Dakota. That's my alarm for my uh, low battery. So when you turn the lights on in the wall, well, it always goes off, right? Yeah, well, I guess it's a good thing. So that way it protects the battery. It shuts all the lights off and stuff like that. So it uh, protects your battery so you can start your truck later on, right? But uh, anyways, just uh, fueled up another 50 gallons up here because I only needed another uh, 37 gallons in order there it goes we are in the dark here we are back in the light that's what I was talking about that Volvo always shuts off right but anyways uh, I only needed another 37 gallons in order to hit my uh, 500 gallon mark for this month so I can get a free shower every day so I figured I'd just go ahead and fill up another 50 gallons that way like I'm on my way home anyways I'll be home tomorrow Probably by lunchtime. I only got another four, four and four and a quarter hours drive back home. Then I'll be home, and uh, so I figured I fill up another 50 gallons. So that way, uh, tomorrow I would get another free shower, and Sunday I'd get another free shower. Monday when I go out, I have enough showers. You know, that way I don't have to worry about it because the Flying J has changed our shower system. So. At least now we get free showers every day once we hit that 500 mark. So here I am. I hit that 500 mark. Lucky me. But uh, anyways, probably go grab me a bite to eat. And uh, probably render this video for you guys. We'll upload it to YouTube. And we'll see you tomorrow again at 5 a.m. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.